Okay, in this video, we're just gonna have a look at how to answer the ABQ. So it applies for most ABQ questions, but just for this one, we're gonna look at the 2018 uh, ABQ itself and answer one of the parts of it, and then have a look at a, a solution to it. So in 2018, they asked about the Celtic Greenway, which is like a cycling and walking trail, and then they asked a couple of questions around. So let's have a look at how we should answer an ABQ. So, uh, first thing most answers need is a statement or a heading. So, I've done a blog post on statements and headings, and it's worth checking out over on uh, the shop page. But ultimately, you just have to give a statement to open. Then you explain and give theory, so textbook knowledge. So, the marks is about 75% for stating and explaining, and then we have a link. So, a link has to be a direct quote from the ABQ text. It has to be given in quotation marks, so that's why I've done it there. And then sometimes a question, uh, depending on the verb, could say evaluate, recommend, or give a benefit, and you need to do that as well. So it's just something to be uh, taken note of. So for we're going to look at A part two from 2018. It says describe two social benefits of the Celtic Greenway project. So that's what the ABQ is about. The marking scheme here, I've just uh, put it in. So it is, uh, you can see it's two points at one plus two plus two. So that means that you get one mark for saying something, two for developing a, a given an explanation, and two for giving a relevant link. So I like to say state, explain, relate, or state, explain, link. Um, and that's how you basically look at nearly all ABQ questions. So your link has to be a direct quote again, just to look at that, and I'll be doing a video on what a direct quote is as well. Um, but you have to give a line from the ABQ text in quotation marks. So... Let's have a look at what I would do if I was answering it before I even begin. So the question asks about describe two social benefits. So then I'd have a quick brainstorm, write down a couple of points on what you think social benefits might be so that when you go into the ABQ text, you'll be able to kind of pick them out. So what would cycling and running on a greenway bring? Maybe healthier people, happier people. Remember, the question is social, not economic. So you can't say jobs or money. So stuff that makes people better off. So like sense of community, mixing with others, uh, being fitter, more active, uh, anything like that, happier outside in nature, um, things like that, that people would benefit from having a safe, secure cycling, running, walking, jogging network. So things like that. When we're going to lay out our answer then, uh, when you're first starting out, you could even like do this on your sheet, lay it out, write state then explain and then relate. And this will just remind you of how you should be structuring all your answers. Um, and then we'll jump into the text and have a look. Normally in the ABQ, there's maybe three or four paragraphs. Uh, sometimes there's an introduction and then each paragraph will kind of have the links for all the, um, for, for most of the points that you're given. So you can see here, paragraph two, uh, I've under I've highlighted a couple of different links that are to do with social benefits. So you can see the first line provision of the safe and attractive walking and cycling route has encouraged a huge uptake of cycling, walking, and jogging among local people. So we're gonna see if we can put that into a social benefit now. And uh, remember the question just said two, so you can see then the next one talks about reducing environmental impact, and the next one about balancing your ways of life, and then scouts and volunteering. So loads to go with. We're going to go with fitter or more active. So statement, make sure we're not just saying fitness or something like that. We want to say something that it does. So more active is shown that you think people will do more or healthier local. So that's our statement. And then we're going to explain or develop it. Develop it. So having better infrastructure. Uh, well, what will that do? It'll enable or allow more people to get active than before. So or provide the a safe place for people to get active. Uh, and take part so essentially this Celt the Celtic Greenway is going to encourage enable allow for more participation so I've said in my explanation having better infrastructure will enable more people to take part in fitness activities and become healthier and enjoy uh, sports and activities so that's going to, our statement will give us one, our explain will give us two, and then our direct link will give us two as well. So your link has to be relevant. So you can see here, I'm picking out the first sentence there, and then I'm going to plop it into my link and put it in quotation marks. It has to appear word for word, and we're going to be able to pick up the mark. So if we think about the marking scheme again for this, it was 
1 plus 2 plus 2 um, for state, explain and link. And let's have a look if and see if we got all 5 out of 5. So more active, healthier locals, have we stated? Yep, yeah, that's good for 1. Having better infrastructure, enable people to take part, etc. That's going to be good for 2 for developing our heading. And then have we given a direct link from the text in quotation marks? Uh, yeah, so that's straight out of that text. So that's 2 as well. So you can see there we're picking five out of five pretty easily. So this is my actual script. I went back and sat the leave insert in 2018 just to uh, have a look at uh, how it's marked and my answers. And uh, you can see here, I got four marks in the ABQ, 80 out of 80. And this is uh, one of my answers. So if anything, I'm making the common error of writing too much, but you can see the red underlined marks there is where I got the marks. So one for saying healthier lifestyles, two for uh, the red lines there and and the extra two for linking uh, and quoting the ABQ text. My second point in uh, the 2018 paper was sense of community. I talked about 10 villages coming together on a project and a sense of pride, which got me the two. And then I actually gave two direct quotes there. You only need one. Uh, so again, falling into that trap of writing too much. So I talk about that actually. Um, I put together a, an ebook and PDF called What It Takes, which looks at the script and tries to look at uh, errors people make. So if you haven't checked out our website, it's thebusinessguys.ie. Lots of free resources, solutions to all leave insert business questions for the last couple of years. And then we also have our, uh, so, so we're just focusing on the ABQ section there, a how to, and then we have our online shop and blog, which features the 2019 APQ pack, which will cover you for this year's unit one, two and three. And also, as I mentioned there, uh, when I went back and sat the leaving surf, I have uh, the script of my marks available. So I got 390 out of 400 um, in it. And then I look at any little errors I made or any little tips I can take from it. So thanks a lot for watching the video. Hope it's helpful. We're going to continue the ABQ uh, theme and have a look at some other things. If you have any comments, any questions, any areas you'd like covered, make sure to let me know and share it with anyone you think who... Uh, we'll find it interesting as well. Thanks a lot.